Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. I have never, ever, 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 ever had so much interaction for this particular video than I have for any other video I've filmed on my channel. Any other, let me tell you, <laughs> I don't even know what to say at this point. I am so shocked. I am so, you guys, okay. So I came up with this idea when I was sitting by myself and I was just like, you know what? A lot of people uh, watch our content, right? We've got you guys, we've got subscribers, we've got followers on Twitter, on YouTube, Instagram, whatever. And you guys watch our content, but we've never actually given you the platform to actually roast us. Okay, we have it. And I actually sat down, too many actuallys, but I sat down and I thought to myself, well, that would be an interesting video concept, right? Let's talk about what you guys, what you guys don't like that we do, whether in our videos, whether in just our daily lives, how we project ourselves on social media, whatever it is, what is it about creators that just absolutely irks you what is it about creators that completely irks you it literally like disturbs you so so much you absolutely hate it right because we have our opportunities we've got the opportunities where in a video i can comment back on a hate comment i can uh give my opinion on something that somebody said about me or my content or whatever but we never give you the chance to roast us I don't know what the hell <laughs> I was thinking. Okay, you roasted us, okay? So I put it on Instagram and I said, guys, just tell me, just tell me, let's keep it spicy. Tell me this is your opportunity to go off at creators and a wow. I Luna, a little bit. Luna, you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys, you just, you don't like us. I needed a drink for this one because <laughs> honey, honey, oh. and, uh, wow, wow, you came for us and uh, well done, well done. Did you want to break my heart a little bit? You did. You really did. You really did. <laughs> um, I hate it when creators say, don't mind my crusty face. At that time, it's 10 p.m. in their house. Listen. <laughs> okay okay whoa 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 sometimes that's just a way of being polite okay yes it's 10 p.m in my house yes it's 7 a.m i'm looking kind of crusty i'm just saying please don't mind my crusty face because you know you guys catch me looking like this and then in a vlog you catch me looking crusty what is the problem if i say that i actually more than anything think it's polite polite yeah Oh, I just did this right now. Okay, lip smacking. It really is distracting and annoying. If I wanted to do that, if I wanted to see that, I would have watched ASMR. I just smacked my lips. <clears throat> you know what the thing is about that? I'm scared because I think I'm guilty of this. I think... I just did it again. I think I'm guilty of this, but then it's it's a tick, it's a thing. Okay, I'm sorry, yeah, there are some content creators who do it a lot more than others do. Amar Batbamdim. Okay. On behalf of all the content creators, Siak Olisa, Siak Olisa. Sure. Okay, wow, the next one. All right, listen. Always apologizing, e.g. I'm sorry about my nails, I'm sorry I'm crusty, I'm sorry about the mess at the back. But I'm not going to be polite. 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 Or, or what, what do, do you suggest we do? Do we go and get our nails fixed first before we record the content? But maybe we need to record the content because we've got deadlines. Maybe we need to record the content because we're going to, because we're going to an event. You see, my alarm just went off. Give me a second. You guys, 
You guys ain't right. For me, that's the point that I don't get. I genuinely feel like if we say I'm sorry for the mess at the back, we are aware. It's called being self-aware. I'm sorry that there's a mess at the back. Or okay, before I switch on the camera, before I let the camera, I must, I must put her the mess at the back. Tell us what you want us to do, okay? But now, what if my nail breaks and I'm going to an event? If my nail breaks and I'm going to an event, I'm so sorry that, you know, it's looking kind of weird. Is it sorry? Is it bad that I say that? Again, it's a tick. A lot of people just say, oh, I'm sorry. Like I bump it, someone bumps into me when I'm walking out of the mall or the, the house or whatever. And someone bumps into me and then I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. But they bumped into me. It's like a tick, man, it's like a tick. And then when we don't say sorry, ooh, did you see that mess in the back of her house? Ooh, I, look, I look no lily. Then you're going to say that. When we don't say sorry, I want to learn sometimes I'll say. This lady says, doing that ask me anything video and then becoming rude to people by not answering their questions. Here's the thing. Nah. Nah. Nope. 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 Yeah? Let me, I have, I have an answer. What I must do? I have an answer, okay? This, it, it's, you're gonna, you know where the danger is with this one? It's because you have people who ask inappropriate questions. Yes, I mean, ask me questions. But the karame guy, a guy sense of, okay, Eriki Bota something that is above board. I mean, if you're going to ask me, Huri, have I had a threesome? Hey? Or if you're going to ask me, Huri, hey, have I, have I, have I, uh, uh, picked my nose and then ate the snot. Like, come on, bro. Like, am I going to answer that? Is this something that you would answer if somebody asked you of the same thing? Let's start there. What the hell are we gonna do now? Let's start there. Because the thing is, you have people who will ask anything, and that's fine. Ask anything. But Luena, how how we guy? Is the masako sigupi? At which point are you going to say, I, oh, I want to ask Kat this, but ish, ish, this might be a little bit inappropriate. Hey, like I really can't ask Kat this question. This is inappropriate. At which point are you going to think that? Or are you going to, uh, are you going to be mad when I respond in the way that I respond? Be like, yo, you know what? That's inappropriate for you to ask me that. I don't like that. And then I block you and whatever. And then we are quarter. Uh, you guys are not being fair. There are certain questions that are really inappropriate that they are, they are bridging that. Uh, yo, uh, yo, yo, yo. I feel like I'm fighting for the creators. I feel like I'm fighting. I haven't even dented this video. I feel like I'm fighting for the creators. Filming themselves brushing their teeth. Can't the morning routine. Now, if I don't film myself brushing my teeth, do you really think that I brush my teeth? Oh, do you think or wait? So she gets up, she takes a shower, she leaves the house. At no point there did I see her brushing her teeth. I need to get a kill. Because sometimes, eh, no matter what we do, let's go back at the loophole. Let's go back at the loophole. And then now we need to show her, no, I brush my teeth, gents. What, what, what must I do? Should I show you the toothpaste? Not the shop. I want to show my dental hygiene. Yeah. That's all I want to do. I really just want to show that the fact that I practice dental hygiene. What is the problem? Can't do another. You wash your teeth differently. What's different about the way you wash your teeth compared to the way I wash my teeth? I don't know. I don't know. This one I can tell you for free that it's not for me. I don't know who this girl is digging at, but she was like, y'all twang unnecessarily. Nah, ha ke twang. In fact, I even feel at some point my English has bugetoness nyana sometimes, unless I'm sitting in a boardroom. But, um, 
I have watched a couple of content creators that, uh, you know, they have a bit of a twang, yeah? <laughs> they talk like the Kardashians, you know? <laughs> Um, <laughs> it's me coming for my people. I'm roasting myself. I'm roasting my colleagues. Yo, Mara, okay. As I was saying, I also remember in one of my other videos where somebody was commenting and saying that uh, South African content creators are now using American lingo for some of their things. Like, petrol is now not petrol and it's gas. And I'm just like... Who are the people you're watching? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, because <laughs> ah, guys, ah, guys, the twanging, honestly, even for me, it, it gets on my nerves a little bit. But Lirwatara sound is one. That's the thing. Like Lirwatara sound, we got our, I can say, like, 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 how do you want our English to sound? That's the thing. I'm trying to be on your side, but I just don't see it. Hi. This lady says, it's the accents and the voice changing for me. It's not a pet peeve, it just makes me laugh. Um, I have come across content creators who do this. Um, the accents, the voice changing, the twanging. I sound like accomplished. Hurry, articulified. Yeah, I understand that. You don't know, we want to sound like our English is Cambridge English. What's wrong with us wanting to sound like that? Ah, uh, I'm just tired. Lebatlar sound the young yan. Lebatlar sound the young. Lelo na le judge too much, man. Why are you judging? You need to be judging what you're watching. Judge what you're watching. What is the problem with how I sound? I lelo na le wrong, le wrong, and we say to you all the time, or if you don't like it. If you don't get it, forget about it. If you don't like it, I get we say that. I get we say that. I'm not going to finish that sentence because I don't want to start any fight. <laughs> All right. Y'all share things with us like your relationships. And then when y'all break up, you don't want to tell us what happened. Why? Why? Can't they run our days of our lives? Aye. 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 No, whoa. Read the poll the run. Where I need to sit down because nah, Rich Forrester broke up with me. Now I need to sit. Right? I'm going to go to my mother, my grandmother, my children, my this, my subscribers. Now I need to tell you why we broke up. Can't you privacy, baby Zangan? You need privacy. Eh? What is the privacy? What is the sense of the word privacy? Yeah. If you guys, all you want to know is that, well, yeah, then why don't you tell us what happened? Okay, he cheated on me. How? With who? When? Oh my God, did you find them at the club? Did you find them together? Oh my God, did you find them in bed together? Why? Why? Would you tell someone you barely know? Would you? Would you tell them your whole entire relationship story? No, how wouldn't it? No, no, let's, no, 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 let's do it, okay? Would you tell somebody you barely know that, hey, this person did this, did this, did this. What if he beat you half to death? What if he beat you half to death? She beat you half to death. You landed up in the hospital. You want to know this information? Why? Yeah. What, which part of our lives? Yeah, what? Which part of our lives as creators can we keep to ourselves? Just like you want to know, Hore, no, why? Why did you break up? Which part of our lives then are meant for ourselves? Which part? Stelenge, headmaster. To rest, 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 before to rest, rest. Master Rustane, Nige. It's simple, this thing must roast on it. Hi. This one is tricky. This one is tricky. Promoting products like they use it daily, can do its marketing fail, a false appearance. Okay, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. I mean, uh, I mean, I mean, I mean. All right, I get that one. I get that one, but business is business, gents. 
Business is business. If this person is being paid to promote the product, they gotta promote the pro product. They gotta promote the product. Okay, if they're being paid, it's like spawning. You wake up, you go to work in the morning, and uh, you're a telesales person for an oil company that puts oil, that puts crude oil in baby food products. That's your job. Do you agree with what you do for your job? No. At least I'd hope not. Shit. <laughs> At least I'd hope not. You don't agree with what you do, but you're at work. You are spawning. And this is what we are doing. We're spawning. So what should we do? What do you suggest we do? Do you suggest, to, okay, no, we turn down everything that we feel that we don't align with? Then how are we going to make a coin? Then how are we going to make a paper? Luna, 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 Luna. How are we going to make a money so that we can continue co producing a core, a product, a, a, a channel, hey? So that I can continue saying, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Because these things involve a money. It's a camera, it's a money, it's a mic, it's a money, it's a tripod, it's a money. But now you guys don't want me to take jobs because uh, uh, I promote, but then it's not in a lot. Like a cut it. I'm just tired. Now, now I understand when something is totally out. I get it. When something is totally out and you know, right, this person, she's not a vegan. All of a sudden, she's promoting vegan products. I hear the chat. It's totally out. When you know that I eat dairy products and I eat meat. I get it. But then, so just because I didn't promote Vaseline, just because you didn't see Vaseline in my videos every day. Now all of a sudden I can't promote it. Ah, gents, 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 gents. I mean, uh, I mean, I mean. Vloggers who literally have cameras on their face because they don't want to show what's behind them. And she says, i.e. their home. One second, Tony. What's going on? What's cooking oil? Okay. All right, let's break it down. Why... Why do you want to see their home? Or why do you want to see what is behind them? Who, who, it's vlogging. I hate maybe you'll see what you see, like the chairs and the plant and all of this. You'll see what you see. But now, and sometimes certain cameras, yo, guys, I feel like, okay, maybe let me explain. Let me explain. Me, I have a relatively short arm, okay? So when I elongate my arm, even though it's right there, and the camera's right there, you're still going to see a majority of my face. You might see certain things in the back. But Lil Luna Wile, but let go lady taba man. Firstly, you don't want us apologizing because our homes are messy. So what you see in the background is messy. You don't want us apologizing. Fine. Now you don't want us slightly hiding it by focusing on our face, okay? You don't want us slightly hiding it by focusing on our face. That we what? You want to look like a contradictor? This is all I got. Oh no, ma! Oh no, ma! Some of you lizzy da, but then you're going to end up saying, oh my God, did you see the flowers in her background? They're pretty much dying. So she can't keep anything alive except herself. Yeah. You. You, 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 and then you put it in the comment, and then when I'm hit by that, it's like, guys, most YouTubers pack things like houseware away uh, when they buy from the shops without washing it. Ah, add lame to the list, add whack to the list.
But house where one? But only a little dusty, the cobo, cut body, that little bubble wrap. So how does someone take it straight out of the why? Why? Hey. Okay. The voice they use. You guys really, really, yell what is and twenty voice, ne? The voice they use. I may not know any of them. Um, but I know for sure that that's not how they speak regularly. Ow. Also, when I, oh, 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 Tyler, come on, get Tyler Banks or Tyler Perry or Tyler what, what, oh, bona, bona lend the things. When I, bona, bona, when I, when I, you know, or that's not the voice that they use regularly. Ow. That's not the voice. Come on. The voice they use. I may not know any of them. But I, I know for sure that's not how they speak regularly. Sister, look at you with the gift of foresight. Look at you with the gift of premonition. Okay. The unnecessary use of the word like. If the context doesn't allow, just don't use it. Like is, is like a tick. I just said like, but I didn't mean it in that way. Like, when somebody's like, like, I mean, I mean, I mean. I mean, uh. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean um, like, 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 I mean, I mean, and then, and then, uh, do you understand? And, 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 it's like a tick. Some people can't get rid of it. It's like one of those things that you know that, ish, I know I say this a lot, but it is what it is about me. It's a tick. They, they're not even aware that they're doing it, right? It's just one of those things. So I don't know. I, I feel like that's a little bit unfair and it's, it's a bit of an unfair dig. Um, sister. Um, telling us to like the video in the intro instead of at the end after we've actually watched. Aumara. <laughs> What's wrong with me saying, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. If you enjoy my content, please don't forget to subscribe, like the video, do it down below. Da -da 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 -da. Let's get into the video. What's, aye, 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 aye. What's wrong with that? If you like my content, please show me some love by liking the video. Okay, my one, who's only bala? That's the thing. The thing is, we mention it, these are like segues, right? We mention them, they are call to actions, right? So when you do, when you do a lot of work with uh, brands and campaigns and whatever, there's like call to action. So this is a call to action. This is what I'm asking you to action out for me, please. If you like my content, if you like, you know, just not the video in particular, but thank you so much. If you like my content and you'd like to see more of it, please do subscribe and like the video. What's the problem? I'm just asking you because at the end of the video, I can say it at the end of the video, but it works both ways. What? But what is wrong? What is it gonna cost you to like a video? I feel exasperated. I'm burning up. I'm burning up on the inside and the outside. <sighs> this is all I got. Okay, what is it gonna cost you to just like the video and let's keep it moving? That's it. It's free 99. When I stinchy got thumbs up. Got thumbs up or stinchy. Thumbs up, yeah, thumbs up. Uh not actually sharing anything in sip or spill videos. Look, I don't do those, uh, but I know my sister does. Um, I don't watch many of them. But the reality is, if the question is a little bit too intense for her or him to give a response, I would rather get lit. Not me, I would rather sip. So should we scrap sip and spill videos? I mean, nah, little nah, little fair. Uh, this lady says American accent. They're all starting to sound like Americans. Let me tell you something about South African, specifically, specifically, 
All right, let me tell you something specifically, specifically about South African content creators. I've seen quite a few who are like starting to sound a bit Kardashian-y, you know? Um, so, hey guys, welcome. But, you know, it's, it's, at the same time, because I'm in the content creating space, I feel like it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a job. You're being professional, right? You're, you're talking to, you know, your client, your people, followers, subscribers, whatever. So when you're at work, your English becomes a little bit more sensual. You know, your English becomes a little bit more accentuated, right? So you, you try and articulate yourself a little better and whatever, but I have picked that up. I'm with you guys on that one. I have picked up that a lot of content creators um, kind of shy away from just speaking English. Speak, speak it properly, just speak it. Um, and would rather speak like this, you know? Just, um, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, thank you so much for being here. Uh, we're going to be going to an event today. It's going to be so much fun. Um, yeah, but before that, I'm just gonna, I'm feeling very hungry right now. So I'm thinking maybe have a salad or sushi. I get it. <laughs> I get it. It seems put on, right? It seems fake. It seems whatever. I get the chat. I get the chat and I'll give you that one. Uh, apologizing for normal things like how they look naturally or for small things like a broken nail. Again, I think this is a thing. It's like a tick for a lot of people um, that kind of goes away when, you know, through therapy and whatever. Like, what are you apologizing for? There's actually a uh, podcast episode that I have on my podcast where I talk about stop apologizing, right? And I get it, but at the same time, I'm guilty of it. I do the same thing. I don't apologize for having broken a nail. I'm so sorry for that. I'm so sorry that I got a call in the middle of the video. I'm so sorry that I'm just giving you a little bit of a distraction moment. It's just, I think, personally, it's just being polite. It's just saying that I'm aware of what I'm doing, and I'm aware that you're aware. Of what I'm doing so I apologize for that um, some things yes are really just menial and really trivial there's no need to apologize for certain things but I would rather exercise that politeness anyway they give false yeah. reviews on brands they don't even use just because they're doing a promo Look, I can't say I, I uh, relate to this because I always make it clear when I'm working with brands that I'm going to give an honest review. And it's one of the things that I, I shy away from um, doing certain work with other brands because I know that, uh, you know, look, there's, there's also ways in which you can do reviews by being... It's not necessarily a false review, right? But it's it's you being critical, but in a professional way. You're like, okay, I like these glasses, but they're a little bit too big for my face. Like, they don't frame my face in the way that I would like. That's an honest review, right? So, it's also truthful in the sense that I'm not really the biggest fan of this particular set of glasses, but I like the frame. I know that content creators are guilty of doing something like this, right? Giving false reviews and saying that, oh, the cellulite product works so well on my skin. Within two weeks, the lines were gone. Or the serum worked so well on my skin. Within two weeks, I had skin like glass, okay? I had skin like Kim Kardashian, okay? And whatever, okay, Kim Kardashian, I don't know. But you hear my chat. And um, I know, but... Again, it takes me back to what I was saying earlier on. It's a job. It's a job. And if you've taken on the job, you've got to do the job. Whenever you don't do the job, what happens? What happens? How tall are you? How is we caught? Because much like you signed a contract for your job, content creators sign contracts for their jobs. And if you agreed that this is what you're going to do, this is what you're finna do. You need to put the food on the table. Come on, guys. Give us a break, man. Shit. I feel attacked, yo. <laughs> I feel... <laughs> 
I feel so attacked. <laughs> but I love it for us. Let's go. Let's keep going. Let's go. Um, them licking their lips every five seconds. Ew. Tasam lom oh man. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> Okay, okay, I agree. I agree. Uh-huh. I'll give you that. I'm not going to contest what I feel like I agree on because Linda, I get kind of irked out if you're constantly licking your lips. What is that? Get a labello, get a zambak, get a lip ice, get whatever. Hey yeah, man, if you need to get rama from the fridge and do this, it's fine. No one is going to judge you if you are out of Eva's mm. lane. The f oh, okay. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I <laughs> the fake waking up and getting out of bed morning routine videos. Hi, <laughs> Dobazana. Like, girl, really? Um, okay. <laughs> okay all right um look i think because <laughs> oh we're acting it out i don't know what you want me to say bro we are literally acting it out i mean you can go to a movie house and go watch an actor who is paid to pretend like they've been sleeping and then wake up, right? To pretend that they've been sleeping. They, they, they're pretending. What is the problem with me doing the same thing? Yup. I'm not even paid half of what that guy is paid. I'm not even paid a quarter of what that guy is paid that you go to your stack clinic course and your new metros for. But when I do it, it's a problem? Why? What if I want to show but what go SBC one Mzanti Fanshan Kinga Ekta? What if keep at a generation? What if my lifelong goal was to be on generations? And maybe somebody who what who 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 manages, produces what what generation sees and she's like this this girl's got good acting skills. Linda, I wanna act. Yes, we all know. It's not rocket science. We all know that I put the camera there, I go right back into bed, I lie down, right? And I'm just like, uh, and I'm just like, but I've been up. We all know this. Oh my God, my hair. We all know this. We all know this. My why y'all gotta make it like, ah. What, how do you think morning routines are done? And then you're gonna come and ask us for the morning routine. You wanna key a problem. What the hell are we going to do now? YouTubers, they act like they're all wealthy. Congratulations! Oh, 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 oh my God. They act like they're all wealthy and they undermine small YouTubers. Um, the next one says, your creators can be rude. You compliment them and, uh, not even a like, but we must support their work. No. Hi. 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 I'm going to stop you right there. You don't must support our work. No. We don't ask you or force you. We ask you to support our work. If you don't, if you feel like it doesn't align with what you're about, we always say that if you feel like my content doesn't align with what you want to see on the tube, feel free to unsubscribe. But we do not force you to support our work. I don't know about any YouTubers who do that, but I know I don't. What I must do. Please, guys, when you watch my videos, thank you so much. I appreciate it so much, but please don't forget to like and subscribe because this helps me, right? Your subscriptions help me. Your likes help me. But I'm not forcing you to do it. 
It's just a call to action. Please do it. If you can, if you remember, please do it. But we don't force you to support our work. I feel like that's a little bit unfair. Um, that I know, and like, and like, no. Yeah. And like you're reaching, you're reaching. Yeah, I'm gonna ask said what I said. I said what I said. I feel like you're reaching. No content creator ever forces you to support their work. No. <laughs> I have. <laughs> it is cool and spicy, eh? They forget that we help them grow. And we're always supporting their work. And we engage when asked. Char! What the hell are we gonna do now? Uh, yes, you do help us grow. Um... But you also stick around because you enjoy our content. And if you don't, you always have the opportunity and option to not subscribe or unfollow or whatever. Um, but you cannot hold us hostage. Hi, Tomasana. Hi, Tomasana. Hi, <laughs> At the fact that we helped you grow. So because of this, Mm -mm. No, no, no. You cannot hold us at ransom. What must I do? Give you a kidney. <laughs> must I give you a kidney for maybe for you to, 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 to show, to see? You know, must I give you a kidney for you to see that I really appreciate what you've done for me? Yes, you helped me grow. Yes, your one subscription has done a lot for my channel and I really do appreciate it. But you cannot make com com comments like this. No, Sudat, no. You can't make comments like this and hold us hostage saying that you forget that I made you. It's like somebody who says that. No one would be with you if it wasn't for me. You forget that I made you. Did you? Yeah. Did you? Did you? Because if we really, really, if we really come back to it, did you? Do I appreciate your subscription? Absolutely. Do I appreciate your support? Absolutely. Do I appreciate your likes? Absolutely. But I'm not holding you hostage. And this, this, even the bands, this comment right here is you holding me hostage because you feel like you made me. Nah, you didn't. Um... Not all, but most, are only interactive when they want to push their views or likes. I can give you that much. I've noticed it. I've seen it myself. Um, they only come into, you know, Instagram or Twitter or uh, uh, YouTube comment section or whatever to just say, hey, guys, don't forget to like. As opposed to saying, hey, how are you? How's your day going? Blah, blah, blah. Just a normal interaction with subscribers. And that's fine. And if you feel like that's unfair, I'm going to give you that. I'm going to give you that. But not all creators are like that. I feel like this is a dig at me. Okay? I feel like this is a dig at me. But let's go. Let's talk about it. Okay? Let's go. Let's talk about it. When they actually forget that they're famous and they use their colloquial languages and forget about us, their international subbies. No, we don't forget about you guys, our international subbies. That is not fair. <laughs> this is all I got. <laughs> Let me tell you why. The only reason why that is not fair is that there are many other content creators all over the world that use their home language in conjunction with English and have thriving channels and do well and are fine and you don't have people complaining. However, I hear your chat. I hear that it might get a little bit annoying when you're watching a video and then I spew a line in Susoto and you're just like, what did she say? I hear it. But here's the thing. It already takes a couple of hours to edit one video. It already takes a couple of hours to add subtitles to each video that you're doing adds another hour or two. 
So you need to understand that sometimes it becomes a lot more work, especially when you are pressured to do something because there's a deadline coming up. You have to upload on Friday. You Friday are your upload days and you're sitting and it's Thursday night. It's 1 a.m. in the morning. It's Friday morning, right? So sometimes it's really, really hard because when you're churning out three or four videos a week, two videos a week, it's a lot to then have to focus on doing subtitles as well. So we, ex we would hope, not expect, we would hope that you would understand that sometimes I may forget to put in a subtitle here or there, that it is what it is, but the majority of the video is in English. I'm gonna stop that one here. And I'm going to film part two of this video right after this. But uh, this one is going to end here and I'll see you in part two.